got our location, people. Let's go. Oh! Oh, that is a hundred times better. I like first person. But if we all could, we'd play Titanfall on, on third person. Yep, set a course. Yep, jump. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho. oh, that's cool. Is it going to load up a whole new area? Starship Frontier, this is United Colony Security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. No contraband on the ship? Okay, cool. Scan complete. No contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. I'm glad. I want everything on your ship. <laughs> you can have anything you <laughs> No, I can instantly steal. <laughs> you got anything? Let me just get my ledger. <laughs> I could trade with them. Wait, what? Can I sell you stuff? Please tell me I can sell. The value. Yes, take. <gasps> oh my god, I could get 3,000 credits instantly. Yes, take them all. I hate them. Goodbye. That's cool. You can just literally talk to any single shuttle. That is cool. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We leveled up, didn't we? Yeah, we leveled up. We have one point. Wait, okay, what, what should we put it in? Um, actually, combat. First off. Ballistics. Ballistic weapons deal 10 more damage. Um, pistols deal a lot more damage. I'm not gonna lie, I do like me pistols. So, let's go with that first off, just so we can have more damage. We might move over to heavier weaponry, but who cares? Oh, you get signal to all the ships around you. Right there. Let's land. Let's land. <laughs> I'm kidding! I have no idea. You might be- Oh, I might have just given them a bunch of stuff for free. It, they it would have told me, right? Because in Fallout and Skyrim, they said, hey, this dude doesn't have enough. Oh, I'm in third person. Oh, that's cool. Okay, let's get out. I'm pretty sure I made the money, right? Oh, yep, yeah, no, 9,000 credits. I'm pretty sure I sold all that stuff away. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's, 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 it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. And even if they didn't have enough credits, who cares? Indigo again? Your memory is uncanny. Hi. And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the trade authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. What does that mean? Uh, modifications. Sure. How about it? <laughs> yes! Yes! Okay, okay, first... Okay, okay, let me let me figure out what exactly we're doing here. Oh. So, when I first was streaming this, this probably, like, all of these, this little, like, modifying my ship sections, probably round up to, like, 30 minutes, which is too much time. But I'm gonna be honest with y'all. This is, like, the best, like, customization option I've seen in a long time. Because it is cool as... Every, everything. I'm gonna be honest with you. You can fully colorize your ship to the extent that you want, although you have to select the parts that you want to customize. You can't just say, oh, I want the whole ship to be this one color. But that's also a good thing, because you know you get to customize it. You also can't, like, just strap things on because, well, it's pricey. Also because if the ship weighs more and things like that, then it requires more advanced technology to, you know, keep it working. That's why, if you look right now, you can see me trying to put extra parts on it. But ultimately, the ship remains the same, because I don't know what I'm doing. I want to have... If I can... Where would I go? 
for a crew. I would try to viewport. It'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Okay. Okay. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Here's what I want to do in the future. I want to make a big ass fucking ship. I don't care what I have to do. I will get a big ship. I will have a ship that will extend everything. And I will do that. I'm going to be honest with y'all. There are moments like this where I'm just like, wow, I'm a bad streamer. Because I just forget what's going on just so I can listen to this. Okay, I'm not interested in a kid talking. Okay, let's be honest. I have standards here. Jeez. Just spent 30 minutes customizing a ship just to hear a kid talk. Oh my gosh. Doing alright. That's literally all I ever say. People walk up next to me and be like, Yo, bro. And they say my name. Like, how you doing? And I'm like, I'm good. Well, I don't know why, this but I'm... This is New Atlantis Transit, or The Net. It provides free transportation throughout the city. We can take it directly to the Mast District. Oh, cool. Let's take it. Yes, take me to the Mast District. That's the slowest bullet train I've ever seen. How you doing? Hope you're not agoraphobic. I don't know what that means, therefore it offends me. The water is quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. Unfamiliar. That is beautiful. This is beautiful. What noises the water makes. How are you doing? I have no idea what you just said. I'm very enlightened. Also threatened. Hi. How are you? I'm doing fucking great. Are you okay? City, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity and always has been. You were talking as if you were right in front of me, but you just walked up. You, you, what? Are you okay, Bosco? Are, like, I get it. It's okay. It's fine. Whatever's happening to you, it's gonna be alright. I'm here for you. Even though I'm here technically one in- the lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Cool. Okay. Hello? Is anyone here? Everyone will be in the library, just inside. Could if Barrett second. were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. Yeah. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Hi. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Uh, pirates attacked and, uh, he told me to deliver it. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? Yeah. What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? I was the only one there, and it was bright lights and uh, music. Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Hmm. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honest to God, what do you expect us to believe in fairy tales? If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? 
Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Just like at first. And to imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. How would you... Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves Easy, that. girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Godric? You're on, Walter. Well... If we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Of course. Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? Hi. <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? You know, I'm all in. What's going on next? You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here. Great. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition Money. to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. Uh, sure. Level up. One small step. Join constellation. Okay. Hi. Thirty-four hours later. The characters are good in this story, but I feel like it, we just need to get along here. All hey. right. Let's talk. So, are you ready to get to work, or was there something else? Nah, I think I got everything. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Hmm. I have to admit, I'm excited for my first mission. the same way when I started, too. There's an electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something but it's not just that I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself and for you to learn more about us I'm going to be sticking with you for this we'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry got it you and me let's go find this we'll need to head to mast Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Got Every it. member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Got it. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Yep. Captain, good day, Roscoe. Captain. Goodbye. You go to the ship. I'll be back. God, this is beautiful. I love this. Already. I barely know anything, and I love this. Uh, because I'm psychotic. Best of your abilities. And to uphold the values of the Vanguard. Honor, loyalty, self-reliance in all your actions as members of the United Colonies Navy. I, I do. do. Then I'm proud to welcome you to the Vanguard. Now, you all have your assignments. Get out there and show them what the UC's made of. Supra et ultra. Cool. Uh, who are you? You look like you know how to handle yourself. Know how to fly. Vanguard might well have a place for you. 
Cool. Don't know what that means. Don't know who to go to. So it's all good. Hi. I'm, I'm going to go talk to this person. Uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with a vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? Aren't I already a citizenship? We have constellation business to discuss first. All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, <laughs> I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks. I say no. Here's Dang. what I got for you two. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Well, talk to him. I'm sure he can, uh, we can make a good offer. Nah, let's just ask him. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Well, thank you for the help. Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. No, oh, brother. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. UC is a good friend to have. I bet. Hey, Sarah, Sarah. Been a long time since I've been to Mars. Soul system doesn't get a lot of traffic. Oh yeah, I bet. Goodbye. I wonder what the what the perks of being with the Vanguard would be. So, if I'm correct. Leap of faith. <laughs> On my feet. Oh, I always liked that statue. It's beautiful, isn't it? I wonder what the artist was trying to represent. You know, I try not to care. You good? By Vectera, by Vectera, by Vectera! I can't believe it! Is it you? Is it really, really you? <laughs> Captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet, constellations shining star of stars. Ah, I just joined Constellation. I'm barely a, a person. Oh, you are definitely the brightest, biggest star in any constellation. There's no maybes about it. I have an eye for these things. Not that you're hard to see with that halo on your head. Although at first, I wasn't sure if it was just the glare. But now that I know it's you, what are the odds? And to think, I almost went for coffee instead. But hmm. I changed my routine for one day, and here you are. It's almost like it was meant to be. I, yeah. Oh, well, I mean, we might have met. Coffee shop's basically my second place. Fantastic! I think that makes us roommates. By rule, we pretty much have to be best friends. Either way, it's such an honor to meet you. Good to meet hey, you as well. Do you mind if I follow you around? Do you need a sidekick? What am I saying? You're a hero, of course you do. Lead the way. Y you know what? <laughs> oh, that is a good point. Don't you need a costume? Good point. I'll start working on it right away, as soon as I learn how to sew. Until okay. then. Maybe I can be a sidekick in training. Do you have an academy where fans can practice uh, groveling at your feet? If not, I can start one. You know what? You know what? Just, just, just you come to my crew. Be disappointed. <laughs> yeah, get on the frontier. Oh gosh! Oh my gosh! Look at that! It's just so much stuff. Okay, I need to figure out what these skills are. Like, I look at the perks and I'm like, cool, but what do they do? Oh, hey, Vasco. How did you get here before me? Did you teleport here? Hi. Please disregard. 
I attempted an informal greeting, but I am dissatisfied with the results. Bosco, stop that, okay? It's gonna be okay. I wanna go to the cockpit. Let's get this crate into space. Oh. Let's get out of here. <laughs> nah, nah, he's in here. Oh, that's so cool. It's very rude of the universe to not welcome you with fireworks when you arrive in space. At a bare minimum, a shooting star would be nice. <laughs> I love this guy. We're gonna go to where we were, where we came from. Fuel consumption. Yeah, no, we'll be fine with the fuel. Who cares? Let's hope we run right into that dude. Dang it. Eh, flashlights. I just want to look. <laughs> oh, okay, so I don't need to pull out a menu. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Let's land. I want to explore Earth. We just wait huh are we just landing directly on earth oh let's get up we're here Am I wearing my suit? I'm not wearing my suit. You know, I think Earth would be a very good place to build like a little outpost. Ooh, point of interest. Let's explore. To see the abandoned wasteland that Earth has become is actually pretty satisfying. Just to know, this is exactly what we did to this place. Gave us so much life and attention. And you want to know what we do? We burn it. Say, so screw you, you don't deserve it. We're almost there. Let's see it. Sorry, I'm, I'm just scanning. I just want to see if there's something I might miss. Geological feature. Purpose? Hmm. <gasps> Ooh. I didn't do that. So this is what Earth has turned into, eh? A forgotten pile of waste. Damn. How about that? Alright, let's go to Mars. Oh, I was like, wait, what, huh? Oh, say. Taken to the nicest places. Is that a flirt? Calm down. Okay, I thought the game was like bugged or something. No, this is actually how Mars looks. 
I mean, we're nowhere near the sun, so I guess it makes sense. This is fucking nighttime. Cynthia. Yeah, you can make it. How much money we spent to hitch a ride to this dusty red rock? We huh. were told there were jobs. Look, 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 I get it. But we just filled our last openings. I think we have a couple contracts ending at the end of next month. It's possible they may not extend them. This is bullshit. I got a wife and kids at home. We can't wait almost two months for a job that may not even exist then. Hey, hey, I get it. There's nothing I can do. It's out of my hands. You can take it up with corporate if you want. Sorry, but I have to get back to work. Come on, forget it. Let's get out of here. Maybe it's not too late to catch a ride back home. Damn it. Yeah, you're right. Ooh, low gravity gives me that feeling I have butterflies in my stomach. Oh, there is low gravity here. Oh, that's cool. Mars. Ah, there's their problems I know you're not so I'm just looking for a guy a vanguard name I forgot his name he ain't been around went off on patrol hasn't been back in since we started or one out to the blackest sea I'm gonna assume that's normal okay so uh we tracked him down if you know his patrol route, oh, please. Believe me, I've heard it. After about round three or four was all he would talk about. He's got a voice that carries. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But <clears throat> he has a tab and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but if I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? Can we negotiate? Oh, fuck. Actually, wait. You got any work? I got a board here in the bar where people post all kinds of spacefaring jobs. Good way to make quick money. I could do that. Mm -hmm. I'll do that. We will just go there. And do all that. Worst case, we can make another jump to. Oh, what the. Thank you. Come back. Yeah. Uh, you don't know who I am, but you're about to find out. You know what? You can try. Okay. Go straight for lasers. Get defensive options instantly. Okay, never mind, we're dead.
Okay. One more. You know what time it is? <laughs> Give me what you got. And now you're dead. So. Okay, let's talk about Morgan. Got those credits? Yes. Let me confirm the email. Okay, let's talk. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love, singing songs, all that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? <sighs> Fine. We'll make do. Ah, what's that? Yeah. Zealots. You ever run into one? <laughs> Completely devoted to a deity they call the Great Serpent. The devourer of the unbelievers. I'll let you guess what happens if they spot us. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it, we could download its logs and figure out where our vanguard was heading to next. Three ships to our one. We cut down to minimal ship power and creep forward. They might not notice us getting closer. But yes, worst case, we fight our way through. Okay. Minimize ship system power to avoid the systems like weapons and shields are easily detected. So for maximum stealth, power down all systems except for one or two bars in your engine. And stay, oh, okay, as far away from the enemy ships as you can, get within 500, okay, 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 got it. Gotta go. Da -da 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 oh, for a second, I thought that was a completely different ship. See if the vanguard uh, dudes was stationed. Never know who else might be scavenging there. Had a feeling. I forget. 
There's a ship just drifting out there. No time to take in the sights. That could be our vanguard. Something's wrong. The ship's weapons are powering up. Get ready. I'm the only one who's shooting. Am I supposed to lock on to like, can I lock on to different parts of them? It's hard to get That's out. It. Start the docking routine. Come yep. On. Let's go rescue that vanguard. Mm-hmm. Clicking. I want to get in here personally. Time to relive my fantasies, baby. Howdy there. You doing just all right? Ah, am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? <laughs> yeah. We need to talk. What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too about a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So, you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? I think it'd just be better if you give it. Hey, I'll trade some weird space rock for a rescue anytime. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Oh. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. Agreed. I guess we just got teleported here instead. It works out, I guess. You're back. Did you? <laughs> we have it. Go ahead. Do the honor. With pleasure. It fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive outfit as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. It's an honor to be a part of this. We're going to do great things together. All of us. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. 
And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. You got it, Sarah. Let's get back out there. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. First, there's an expedition that Samco has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Hmm. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Alrighty. Until later. Nah, I don't care about that. Alrighty, everyone, that's gonna be the end of the video. I thank you all for watching, and I hope that you enjoyed. Please have yourselves a great day as you exit out of the video. And of course, you know, the typical YouTuber thing. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you hated it, hit the dislike. If you want to say something, there's a comment right there. And if you want to see more, there's a subscribe button and the bell. Anyway, thank you all. Have yourselves a great day.